Welcome back inside the Suburban Ford 7 Sports Cave. The Detroit Sports Commission Prep Kickoff Classic, I believe, is in its fourth year? Twelfth year. Close. Again, no math involved for me. Twelfth year this has been going on, and, and it just gets bigger and bigger every single year. Today I am proud to bring onto the show head coach from the Detroit Martin Luther King program, Tyrone Spencer and his young you're young. He's going to be a senior. This is Ambry Thomas. He's uh, one of the t most sought-after cornerbacks in the entire country. And from Southfield, a and head coach Tim Conley. He's in his 11th year in the Southfield School District coaching, but his first as Southfield a and is a new branded uh, hybrid school in Southfield. And he is joined today by Lorenzo McCaskill, senior linebacker. Guys, the prep kickoff class. I'm going to start with you because Detroit has, Martin Luther King has been in the news because of the, the passing, of the tragic passing of Dale Harvey. Uh, Harvell, excuse me. Um, how have you guys been able to just rebound from that over the past tur months? Probably turbulent for you guys. Yeah. No, really, we just, um, you know, Coach had that resilient spirit. And I think that his spirit has resonated within us, even though he's gone. And, you know, that spirit has helped us keep going, you know, as we've been practicing and going through. And the guys been responding real well. So it's been real good. Ambry, what about you guys from a, from a player's perspective? You guys been rallying around this a little bit and trying to trying to move forward together? Yes, uh, we're actually moving ahead pretty faster than I thought, and like we just ready to play. We know what this season is about and who is dedicated to. Your first opponent, a pretty good one, Coach. You, you got your hands full with 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 this squad yeah, over here, but uh, what about you guys? How are you guys feeling as you guys continue to? This is a new kind of territory for you guys. Give us a little bit of a, yeah, a, an example. A a wonderful opportunity, uh, the community, Southfield uh, community and the Lathrop Village community coming together, one school, and uh, we're just really excited. So once again, going down to the kickoff classic, getting an opportunity to showcase our team, our band, our cheerleaders. We'll probably have 350 kids down there and all those organizations. It's going to be really nice. Lorenzo, so. it's got to be interesting because you used to have a rivalry with uh, you know, Southfield and Southfield Lathrop. Now you guys are kind of same team. Is it kind of new teammates? How are you guys bonding as you yes, get, get uh, together? We're coming along good. It's a new team. You know, we come from where we don't even like red because <laughs> that was our rivalry. So now we wear it and those are like my brothers now. Yeah, and you guys got to be excited. I mean, yeah. fusing all that talent is going to, for you, you're probably like. That's a, yeah, it's a wonderful opportunity. Let's, let's I'm really started. excited, yeah. All right, so you guys against each other. I mean, this is going to be one of the headliners of the Prep Kickoff yep. Classic. I mean, this was a no-brainer for you guys as coaches and administration to get together and play this right. one, right? Right, no doubt, no doubt about it. It's going to be good for the community. It's good for high school football to have good teams like this playing. Who's going to win? I mean, come on. <laughs> we're not, we're not gonna, hey, I want to get a little trash weeks, talk and start, you know? We still two weeks of practice. We need every two day. Weeks we, of practice. we need every day that we can. Working hard, working hard, working yeah. Hard. Coach speak, working coach hard. speak, coach speak. All right, let's take a look at the upcoming schedule for this prep kickoff class because this is a slate of games over three days that is just monstrous. Look at this. On Thursday, we got Woodhaven versus Lincoln Park. 4 o'clock, Chippewa Valley and Lake Orion at 7 o'clock. That's on Thursday. These all games, of course, all at Wayne State on Friday. Uh, Allen Park versus Taylor Kennedy, 4 p.m. Canton versus Dearborn Fortson at 7. And then on Saturday, August 27th, Chelsea versus River Rouge at noon. The headliner, Southfield Arts and Tech versus Detroit King at 3. And then Detroit Cast Tech versus Oak Park at 6 o'clock. And we're talking about some of the biggest high school names, uh, players that are going to be in the state that are going to be looked at by Michigan, Michigan State schools all across the country. Uh, two of them right here. Guys, how are you guys looking forward to all the talent that comes there? I mean, you guys got to be excited to watch other teams that are around there play, right? Yes. Uh, actually, it's going to be like, it's just going to be like a great atmosphere to watch all the talent playing together. And it's just like, I want to see what everybody about this year. Like, yeah, I mean, and then Friday nights, you know, yeah. every Friday night, I mean, you got some real good talent on your team as well, just to showcase your abilities off. I mean, this is a, a scouted event pretty heavily. Yeah, it's a big deal. It's a lot of great teams, you know, we're going to come out and play. The 12th year of the Detroit Sports Commission Prep Kickoff Classic, not fourth. I will work on that. My memory is a little shot today. Guys. Congratulations, thank you so much. Tickets available online or at the gate for $10. You can get that and get set up because that's coming, what, a week or two away? Woo, high school football is here. All right, final thoughts coming up right after this break on the Suburban 47 Sports Kid. Guys, each got to take a shot at the basket. Let's see, right over top of the, right top of the hoop. Let's see it. There it is. Oh! <laughs> 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 right? <laughs>